Cabergoline is a long-acting dopamine D2 receptor agonist. Studies have shown that it inhibits prolactin secretion in the pituitary lactotroph cells. Prolactin is a protein hormone which is most commonly known for enabling female mammals to produce milk. However, there are many other functions for prolactin in both males and females. When taking cabergoline, prolactin doesn't get secreted from the pituitary gland, which in turn causes prolactin levels to reduce. In males, the most commonly known effect of prolactin is during and after ejaculation. This is called the sexual refractory period. During this time, the male will lose interest in sex and feel satisfied. The main reason why bodybuilders use cabergoline is to block the negative side effects produced by increased prolactin levels in the body that may occur when running a cycle of a particular anabolic steroid such as trembolone or nandrolone, aka decadurabolin. Using caber reduces the risk of prolactin-based gynecomastia, aka bitch tits. A spike in prolactin can also cripple your sex drive. Even when you do not run a compound that increases prolactin, caber can still help normalize your libido when you are playing with your hormones. Caber can also be used in bodybuilding to satisfy cravings and stay lean. It has a mechanism of mimicking dopamine being produced from food intake. When you take cabergoline, the dopamine being released can act as a pleasure chemical, which can make a bite of that pizza satisfy you rather than eating the whole pie. Many bodybuilders who take cabergoline report improved sleep thanks to the dopamine mimic. This allows you to sleep more, deeper, and longer. Deeper sleep means better recovery time for the muscles. When we are on a cycle or when coming off a steroid cycle, our sex drive can be altered. Sometimes in good ways, but many times in bad ways, especially when trembolone is involved. In this instance, if libido and sex drive is an issue, caber can be added to your cycle or post-cycle therapy to aid in prolactin level rebalancing. Cabergoline has a half-life of three days. Caber can be taken twice a week, and the recommended dosage is a quarter milligram per dose, which is fairly moderate. Caber is a very potent drug and should be run very conservatively. Make sure you know what you're doing with it.